Hey guys, so normally I'm posting about Africa on YouTube, but now it's going to be very different. Actually, I want to share something very special with you. The past few months, I actually changed continent. I left Africa for the Middle East. Right now, the sunset you can see and Rafiki there behind. I'm actually sharing a beautiful walk camp with some other overlanders here in Saudi Arabia. Because now the second part of the expedition, I'm driving from the south of uh, the Arabian Peninsula, Oman, to Iraq and then after Iraq let's see what happens actually I was in Oman and then I heard about the Dakar and I'm like oh that would be so like you know frustrating to be in Oman just uh, like a few thousand kilometers away and not being able to see the Dakar let's drive straight to Saudi Arabia just to see the Dakar the past three days I've been witnessing amazing things that I'm going to share now in this video. Now I'm resting and tomorrow I'm going to rest as well because you know it's been a lot of driving for me recently. So on this coming Monday in two days I want to drive straight to the coast of Saudi Arabia where the um, final of the of the Dakar is going to happen. I mean I'm in Saudi Arabia anyway so I don't want to miss that. It's going to be 2,000 kilometers even a little bit more. I'm right in the middle of the empty quarter almost. From here is going to take me like two full days 1000 kilometers per day <laughs> and uh, probably I'm going to do like another YouTube video about what I'm going to see the next few days but I really want to share that in real time because it's just so insane to leave that this is still me I'm still on the road I never got back to Europe yet it's been two years now there's so many things to share about Africa with you about the Middle East now it's still Rafiki me a little, a little updates on Rafiki but you will see that in the next episode and uh, hopefully you will enjoy this very special real-time adventure at the Paris Dakar enjoy it. get to uh, Shabata where uh, normally the Dakar is going to camp I can see fence like on both sides so I think it's a military zone here so while Felix is peeing <laughs> Always to bother people, it's very important. The road is very nice, smooth and perfect, but you have like they said some potholes and for me this is not potholes. <laughs> Probably when you come from Europe, yeah the road is uh, yeah, a bit real. But coming from Africa, the road is perfect. Don't worry, there is no pothole in Saudi Arabia. <laughs> this is the new road. This is the old road. New, old. Old, new. Old, new, new, old. I want to go first. That's my plan. Because when you go first... Ta -ta 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 -ta. I'm so annoying. I just, I love like this kind of weird roads. And I just told Felix, okay, I go first. And I just left. <laughs> Poor him. He has to uh, deal with me. Felix, if you watch this video, I'm so sorry.
to know that I feel much better. I needed that. So now Rafiki and me, we are happy. Felix is, uh, I think, uh, is uh, tired of me. <laughs> He's like, putain, je so angry. Hey, is the Dakar or is not the Dakar? Bon, bah, it's the Dakar. So I adapt. Voilà. I'm adapting now. Mm -hmm. Mashallah, we are stuck! How beautiful is that? Well, I'm more stuck than you. Uh, you don't, don't ever reverse. Well, it's easy to get out. So it's me again, deflating the tires uh, in order to reverse a little bit, a little bit more to boost the car and to go there. Hey, there are oven and just there. Oh, the rubbish. Ah, oh, merde, okay. And inshallah we can make it. I'm dead, I forgot to film. So this is like, the road is recovered, covered by with the sand. And uh, I could actually, I took like two mass tracks and now Felix is coming. He won't wait for me. <laughs> I'm sweating. I'm going to drive here, look. So we have to inflate the tires to get back on that road where you see the tracks. Guys, this is the camp for the Paris Dakar here. So we with Felix and we met other overlanders. We're now finding a way to park somewhere. I just met the medical staff of the Paris Dakar and they helped me to defend the tires <laughs> so we can have a little drive in the dunes. We're going to follow them somewhere and it's uh, obviously they are French, so Francais, so it's very cool. And the other one is here helping Felix. <laughs> invited Felix and I uh, here to these wonderful people and they made spaghetti nice so I don't know if you can see but we have the medical staff of the Paris Dakar ils sont en train de mettre leur petit lit comme ça ils vont me veiller dans Rafiki toute la nuit <laughs> non je dis vous allez me veiller toute la nuit pendant que je dors dans la voiture <laughs> Beau, ça. Bah ouais vous me veillez Mais vous, tu, vous... Vous... Attends mais la chance quoi C'est ça Putain c'est trop bien comme vous êtes garé Et là on domine tout, la... tout le camp de l'autre côté 
Euh... Euh... Ma tante est pas mal. Non mais regardez le cadat. Il vient de site. C'est un professionnel de site. C'est trop stylé. Attends, tu m'as dit ouvre, mais je peux rentrer du coup oui. Ok, bah c'est maintenant c'est la mienne. Ah non, bah tu me dis rentre oui. Oui. Everyone is here waiting and basically so you can see some overlanders overlanders so là c'est les véhicules du Dakar vous en voyez aussi là-bas et en fait tous les photographes all the photographers they climb the dune ils sont derrière la dune et ils attendent en fait parce que les mecs le premier à ouvrir c'est les, les motos ils vont arriver de là-bas jusqu'ici et vont passer entre ces deux lignes là-bas donc nous on attend ici tranquille et ensuite on va monter là pour prendre des bons petits footage des belles petites photos et là je vais rejoindre tous les moches I'm with humans look it's very rare <laughs> with humans I have humans everywhere no lions helicopter and the first guys are arriving from here oh putain c'est énorme I'm going to leave Rafiki here and I'm going to leave Rafiki here and I'm going to walk to the dune. All the photographers, the photographers, they are all there. You see? So, in fact, my strategy is to follow them. The strategy is to follow them and to see if I can uh, get some nice footage in the rear. The last, second last piece for you. You serious? It's a... Guys, a Toyota is coming! A Toyota is coming! Uh... 
Bon bah guys, I follow you hein. just insane um, it's amazing to see that from like in, in like in real life um, it was amazing I uh, so many many Toyota Hilux uh, probably I don't know I would be curious to know how many Toyota Hilux amongst the cars uh, I think it's like probably 80% of the cars were like Toyota Hilux um, for a reason so that's also the reason why I have got a Hilux um, and uh, and then the bikes it's so physical like, I really admire the guys uh, like racing with the, car, with the bikes and the trucks it's like spectacular par contre frère je vois pas en fait là je ne vois pas I don't see I don't see I don't see it is dangerous voilà now it's busy oh putain the helicopters Everything is packed now. Look at that, all the trucks. Insane, all the helicopters for the Dakar. Ça c'est bien ça Ah putain mais non c'est trop bien Ah je veux rester là pour toujours Ah oh, putain c'est trop stylé frère il faut se tirer les plans du cul Copain Overlander. Bon, basically, ouais, oui, j'étais juste qu'une de ma vidéo en fait. <rire> Je rigole. So basically, we could enter the camp and uh, I'm following these guys. They are crazy. 
and, uh, <laughs> and uh, it's really cool because we just saw the truck with the three women uh, driving so one is the pilot the co-pilot and the navigator and we're basically inside the camp and it's actually really cool and we just pretend uh, it's fine <laughs> voilà. it's huge it's massive there are so many trucks everywhere cars uh, actually i'm looking for the bikes because I, I haven't seen bikes yet so i really can't believe i'm in the camp of the paris dakar i mean not paris dakar now the dakar is insane so it's just uh, it's really cool qu'est-ce que t'en penses du coup ça va bien ah, bah, le billet d'entrée n'était pas trop cher donc euh, on ne s'est pas putain. privé voilà voilà bah, le billet d'entrée euh... <rire> Tu veux que je me contrôle Toyota Hilux, 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 Hilux. The Crown Prix of of here. I don't know if you can hear, but I'm literally going to show you. I'm literally next to the camp. Voilà. They are here. And I'm here. Le Dakar. Moi. Les coureurs du Dakar. Charlene. 